what the fuck? It came from a can. On today's episode, what do we got, Lofi? We have some polar sardines. Whoa! Bristling. They're bristling with goodness. Br Dude, bristling. I gotta say. Uh, yeah, let's look at the, the can. Top? Yeah. Holy shit. That looks. You might think this is like a sticker or a label. Yeah. They put on this. I mean, that's definitely what it looks like. But actually, that's no. That's a. That's a see-through top. Yeah. Where you can see the fish inside the yeah, can. Yeah, you can see the bubble. Yeah. This is so you can, like, level your furniture as you're building it from <laughs> Ikea. You know, you get that, you get, oh, oh, there it is. Boom. Yeah. Dual use. <laughs> exactly. We have level sardines. Yeah. But wow, what a presentation, huh? Oh, Shit, that bad. wasn't a good presentation. No. I went the fuck out of that. What a professional. Uh, All right, damn. so we got to thank MW Polar for yes. sending this out to us and all the other MW Polar items we've tried recently. Which have all been amazing. Thank very you so awesome. very much. Yeah, they just don't make amazing waffles, is all. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. I mean, it's not their fault. Right? Yeah, who I knows mean... if we use, like, the fresh product, but no, this is, like, already cooked to perfection. Can't cook it anymore. <laughs> all right, Lopi. All right. Jump in there. Try some of that fish. I mean, you're probably going to want a cracker or something when you're at home. Yeah. But, um. This is the rules of the show. Yeah, we're going to try it right out of that can, baby. See what it's like. Here we go. They look good. Definitely a great flavor. Lots of smokiness to these. It's a lot softer than like a tuna fish or something. And uh, even though it's kind of a a whole package in there, it's just kind of like, you know, the whole fishy. Uh, you can enjoy it as though it was just like a spoonful of tuna fish. Yeah, because that's the consistency it is. I mean, it is cooked to the point where um, all you're going to experience is a nice, you know, smoky fish sort of kippered uh, meat there. Like, you can get sardines every now and then that aren't processed too well. Um, they will have the innards and stuff still inside. They come out really fishy flavored and that can set you off a little bit. These, that's not going to be a problem. There's a lot of smokiness. Yeah, you can smell them. And it's not like, oh god, somebody opened a can of sardines, it's like, oh man, that's delicious no, like, like, Yeah, like you smell the smoke, it's not mm -hmm. fish. And so, I asked Lofi about the, the tail. <laughs> like, every time I've eaten a fish and there's been a tail on there, <laughs> that's been the worst thing, because it's a fucking tail. Very delicate. <laughs> I wired the fuck out of that fish. Sometimes, like when you get sardines in the can, because they're about yay big versus yay big, like you can taste the spine or you can feel the spine. Like it still crumbles and stuff, but these, it's just fish. Like all you can. Mouth feel is the flesh, and the smoke is delicious. It's not like fake. Um, you don't get any more of these. <laughs> these are mine now. I have eight <laughs> other cans, so I'm fine. <laughs> yes. When I think of sardines in a can, I don't typically. I really don't think of them about this size. I think of them like the. The bumblebee tuna, you know, like they're so like about twice the size, yeah. triple the size nearly. Yeah. Where when you eat it, like you get a lot of that fish flesh texture. It's like a whole mouthful, just a part of it. Now, don't get me wrong, I love sardines, even that scale. But there's just something so delicate. When they get larger, they might have a little bit more problem like having the exposure to the um, oil and seasonings. Because the, mm. just the piece of fish is bigger. Yeah. So it might not hit the inside. The flavor would not penetrate as well as it has here. Like these remind me a ton of those magnificent sprats we had so long ago. Oh, dude, yeah. These are so much like that in flavor and sort of texture. Uh, th this kind of sardine, it just melts in your mouth. And it's so good. You don't need a bunch of mustard or sauce that's like these are steeping in you know like a lot of sardines have or like that super super saltiness 
These don't have that. They just have a such a good smoky, yeah, kind of kippered flavor. These are fantastic. I absolutely love these. And uh, I already love sardines anyways, but like these things are like, they're a step above what you typically get. NW Polar, canned sardines. Those things are delicious. Look for the little package where you can see the fish inside of it. That's the one to get. I'm not really sure, honestly, how, how, how many other types of sardines they sell. I'd definitely be down to try some more because those are delicious. Mm -hmm. I think out of all the products they sent us, easily my favorite. Yeah, they're not bad. They're those, definitely not mushrooms. Yeah, and like I wasn't even so opposed to the mushrooms when eating them by themselves. <laughs> It's just, well, even in the waffle, they were the best waffle. <laughs> yeah, I like the mushrooms. <laughs> get the good. mushrooms, too. Yeah, the mushrooms are awesome. But get these sardines. They are absolutely delicious if you like any sort of smoked fish or sardines. And get if you those like herring them, fillets, too. If you like them both, then you're, you're going to be like me here and just be like in a, in a flavor sensation world of deliciousness. <laughs> <laughs> this has been a Game from a Can. Please like, share, subscribe. Go check out MW Polar. Also check out Lofi on twitch.tv slash Lofi Molasses. Yay, thank you. Check out all of our social dates. Thanks for watching.